G'day, I'm Warwick Schiller and I want to give you a little hint about training horses is you want to try to make it things easy for the horse and what made me think of this is this is a uh, three-year-old warm blood mare that arrived here a couple of weeks ago and she arrived uh, by horse transporter and the owner met the transporter here and uh, it was late Saturday evening and they called me at home and the owner said the transporter can't get the horse in the barn she just won't go on the concrete she's scared to death of the concrete so uh, and she said I've got to go can you meet the transporter over here and and help get him get help get her in the barn I said sure and so you know this concrete opens here in front of the barn and, and the, the door to the barn is, is over there anyway so I drove in the gate which is over here behind us and I looked over and the horse transporter has got her trailer parked exactly where mine is right now basically in front of the doorway anyway she said the horse doesn't want to go on the concrete well this is a basic, was a basically unhandled warm blood, been living in the pasture somewhere, has been handled minimally, okay? So I said to her, well, it's not the concrete. She doesn't want to go between the, the thing and the barn. She goes, oh, no, it's not that. She just doesn't like the concrete. I said, you tried to get her between that truck and that barn. And she said, yeah. And I said, just move it. We'll just get, anyway, she finally got mad and she left, okay? And the, this mare was turned out, one of these little turnouts back here, and then I had to catch her. Well, after I got her caught, I said to my wife, okay, I want you to time this and see how long it takes me to get her in the barn. So she started her stopwatch and I walked up, so there was no trailer here now. I walked up straight towards that doorway. I walked up to the doorway, up to the, to the concrete. She stopped, she, she stopped and she sniffed it. And then uh, I just waited for her and then I stepped backwards and she stepped forward and off we went. 22 and a half seconds it took this horse to get on the concrete. But the, the big thing was, was that lady was trying to get this horse to do two new things go between a trailer and a building and go onto concrete. I removed one of those things and it took me 22 seconds. So that's just something to think about. Try to break things down to steps and don't expect your horse to do two things when they can't do one of those things separately from each other. I don't, you know, I don't think this horse would have walked between this trailer and this building if this concrete wasn't here, okay? It didn't like that closed space and it also didn't like the concrete. So the lady was just making it hard. All she had to do was move a trailer in. And like I said, when I told her to move it, and I said that was the problem, she tried to tell me it wasn't the problem, and she's very experienced at this stuff and all that sort of thing. But anyway, yeah, it took me 22 seconds to get her in the barn, and it was no big deal. So anyway, I hope that gives you something to think about. See you guys next time.